Well, I chose a Baron. King Air Baron or something? Don't know. Here it is anyway. And um, it's for me, it's more difficult to fly than the 737. Mainly because I've never flown this one before. Um, and also, well, it's I don't know how the autopilot works properly. Uh, the ILS, I can't find an ILS. There is no ILS on this airport anyway. So um, I don't know. So it's a bit jittery, I'm afraid. But we did land okay, if a little fast. Um, I killed the engines, killed the throttle. But um, uh, I don't know, just weird on this plane. Anyway, that's where we are. It's a twin prop. Hey, jerky. I'm going to have to sort this out. Anyway. So, the airport is over here because I had no ILS to line up. So I thought, shall we go for it? Yeah, it's going way too fast here. See, down here is your knots, indicated airspeed, which is 170 knots. Uh, we should really be landing, I'd say, around about 80 knots, 70 knots. I'm putting the flaps down to create more drag. But I couldn't kill the engines. There's nothing on the road here. Obviously, they've heard Harding Airways is about to land. Anyway, I did land on the runway, and I stopped just, just off the tip of it. Um, I used reverse thrust, which I didn't know this aircraft had. Now it should. I can't shut the engines down. And then I put reverse thrust in any second. It just started. Stop, 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 stop. There we are. So sorry for that, not a very good flight, but um, I'm going to try and get better at this one as well. Lots to learn on this program. Um, yeah, thanks for watching and watch me. Um, well, that's it really. Watch me in the future. Um, it's up to you whether you fly with Harding Airways. Uh, but anyway, thanks a lot. And welcome to Australia.